fucked up, dude. Oh, speaking, I guess this whole fucking episode is going to be smoking themed. But um, <laughs> did I tell you guys about vaping for kids? No. Did I? Uh, you mentioned it to me. I think that was uh, last weekend, though. I don't it, think it was, was during yeah, the podcast. Bu- it was, uh, yeah. yeah. wasn't during this. So we recently moved and um, moved into this house. And, you know, the, the kid's still trying to, like Gavin, he's still uh, mingling to get into the neighborhood to, to just try and get people's phone numbers, get new friends. He's just not, and and no matter where you are, no matter how social you are, you're not you're not gonna immediately fit in or bond or connect with those around you, especially at that age. It's a lot hard, I you know. So he, uh, you know, I ask him every day, "How'd your day go?" and everything, and he's like, "Oh well, I almost vaped." Yeah, because we went for a walk, and there's a store by us, a vape a vape store. It's got vape in the name. It's like, oh, I know what that is. I'm like, oh, you're doing that already? This is a joke. And he's like, well, I, I didn't do it. I thought it was bad. I'm like, wait, what the fuck are you talking about? So I guess, I'm, I'm, like, I'm like, yeah, I, who, who, where, the, where the hell did you vape from? But was it was there some, like, you know, kid who just skips school and s- sells it in the parking lot? He's like, no, no, one of my friends in, in, in my class has it. I'm like, okay, so he's in your class. Did he flunk a shitload and he's, like, 16? He's like, no, no, he's my grade, he's my age. I go, why does he have a vape? And I went online, did some research. They have vape now for kids that's vitamins. Hmm. B12, vitamin C. And which is completely fucking ridiculous. Because when I picture this situation, I just picture this kid smoking vitamin. Just I just picture this kid in a leather jacket like, yeah, you, you kids do your homework. Not me. <sighs> you know? <laughs> and like, like, what the fuck? How is that? You know, I, I just watched Super Size Me recently, too, and and showing how, like, they market to kids with all these play pay places and shit sure. for, uh, for McDonald's. It's like, how is that not a fucked up thing for kids to be like, oh, start early, vape that vitamin C. Oh, you're deficient and, you know, oh, you're a fucking diabetic and you need some diabetic medicine to vape, you know? Like, I don't know. I, I think it's just kind of crazy that that was a crazy fact that I found out. That... I don't know. I'm not surprised. Not surprised. It's pretty Got cool. Nothing. It's pretty cool. I mean... Would you be the vaping 10-year-old? The uh, Man, if they had that technology at the time, hell yes. <laughs> but Yeah, fuck those Flintstones vitamins. Yeah, right? Those Flintstones. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know what we did, John, with uh, the uh, when cough syrup was cool. That was fucking great. We weren't 10 years old, man. <laughs> <laughs> Like ten and a half, well, eleven. That, that, that's what it does to you. It makes you think that you did it at ten years old. I don't fucking remember when I did it. What? How long? When was that? I think that was like sixteen, seventeen. Sixteen, seventeen, really? It was definitely high school. Well, it was definitely. I know it was definitely before we could get alcohol because <laughs> we were trying to get <laughs> fucked up on something. Not be Lil Wayne. Just listening to sipping on some scissor and be thirty six mafia thug, because because no, actually that reminds me. Recently, I started playing Silent Hill, and the reason the thing that pissed me off the most. Okay, I was telling John earlier, and Bill that I couldn't play Silent Hill because it's just too hard, and I couldn't find the flashlight in the fucking game. So pretty much the whole game is black if you play it without the flashlight. So. The one thing that I realized, though, that I did like, that that brings me back. Don't you laugh, you bastard! My, I need my flashlight. All right. No, but was, dude. I remember this. I don't know if you. Re- this is. I'm just okay. I'm gonna tell you how I remember it, and you know I got shitty fucking memory. But I remember. I think your dad went on vacation or something, so we had the apartment to ourselves, and then I think your sister went on a sleepover. And, it, and we were snowed in, and then I had fucking cough syrup, and then we played Silent Hill all the way through without sleeping, and that was the scariest shit I ever fucking experienced. It was a great experience, and now when I play it, I'm like, I don't want to have to fucking drink cough syrup to <laughs> to to have that terror again, you know? <laughs> why, why do these motherfuckers come up with games that aren't scary, you know? Do you remember that, John? 
I remember playing a lot of Silent Hill, but I don't recall that day. Uh, side effect of the cough syrup, I presume. Yeah, must be. Well, I do remember when... Do you remember Triple C's? Yes, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, because I, I remember somebody told us to take eight when you're supposed to take like two. So I think... Didn't you take 16? No, I think I took eight. Okay. Because I thought, I, I think I, I'm pretty sure I took like 16 or 32. And yeah, so that explains a lot. And Not then being played able to some find Silent fucking, Hill? Well, and, and that's when I couldn't find a flashlight. And I was like, John, you play this shit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See, man, you got to get some allergy meds then. Some allergy meds? Yeah, is that the triple C is like the Benadryl and shit that you just pop tons of it? I, I don't know. I never... I, I, I just thought about that recently because I was going to pick up some meds and they actually have triple C's behind the counter now. Hmm. It's cough and cold. Yeah. Gotcha. Well, I know I had a lot of friends that would abuse like allergy pills like Benadryl and shit and you take enough of that and then you trip and then vomit a lot. I've never heard of that one. Well, you're missing out. It's never too late, John. Have I you know- guys ever heard of mud drink? No. Yeah, is that the, like the like Novocaine stuff where you drink it and it numbs you? Like, I I don't, like Novocaine? I don't know. If, I don't know if it's Novocaine. I know it's kind of like cough syrupy, but it but you have to get it prescribed. And I guess gangsters these days. I'm too white to know this. I was gonna ask my my black friend about this, but he didn't. He he was just laughing at me. Like, what's mud drink? And I I guess I read online. It's kind of like uh, a lot of rappers they mix. This like really dark cough syrupy, numbing drink with Sprite, and it just really fucks you up. I guess that's what's kind of making Lil Wayne have seizures and shit. So, yeah, I don't know. <laughs>